if you ever sold and never seen it Mine's made of gold, you depleted I've been out the flame like a phoenix And my life like the blues need a Kleenex Tryna plant a seed but you can see it When they said you never loved me, they believed it How I'm still alive from the bleeding Someone pinch me cause I'm dreaming Now my heart broke from a dark throw You in shark mode, tearing apart folks Still you come around and push a knife in me Kicking it with family like a wife would be Stone every night you my Medusa I know you the reason why my circle looser Only in the bedroom I cuff you I would rather go out screaming fuck you If you had a soul I would let it go What's up guys, your boys are back. I'm Ryan, my man George. Yeah, what's happening guys? How you living out there, man? Shout out to the free thinkers, of course. Shout out to everybody that's following us on Def2 Radio, our Instagram, and Def2Radio.com, our website, D-E-A-F number two, radio.com. Make sure you guys follow us on both of those platforms. It's a great way to support the channel and a great way to get on our radar. As far as requests are concerned, the information for both will be in the uh, description below. And as always, guys, make sure you like, subscribe, notification bell, make sure it's set to all so you get all our videos as they drop. Up and coming artists, man, you know what to do. Click the link in the description. We'll do about 60 seconds of your song in the front of one of our up and coming videos. Get you some exposure. Or if you got a full song, we get you hooked up on that as well. So uh, that information will be in the description below. Check it out. All right, man. So we are getting back to Marlon Craft, man. We're doing Muggsy Bowes. What y'all know about Muggsy Bowes? Muggsy Bowes. Muggsy, Muggsy gets no love, man. Muggsy. Man, shout out to the little guys out there that's Yo, doing big things. Hell so. yeah, man. Yeah, Muggsy Bowe's a low-key legend, man. I'm you know telling you. He's just a legend just for being, what, 5'4", five, 5'3", five, 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 five? I think he five, was, right? Three. Wasn't he? Yeah, he was 5'3", bro. Yeah, crazy. That is crazy. So he's, he's shout out to Muggsy, man. We from Baltimore? Man, shout out to Baltimore. Not Baltimore. Baltimore. Not Baltimore. 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 <laughs> shout out to y'all, man. Method Man. You know the legend, brother. You already know what's up with Method Man. Let's get into it. Marlon Craft and Method Man, Muggsy Bogues. I pulled up in the Muggsy Bogues with the pennies Cause I'm short on time So don't be short on a penny In our New York they would envy the flavor Now that's a bunch of Hold on, hold on yeah, He kind of kicked it off I pulled up in the Muggsy Bogues with the pennies Cause I'm short on time So don't be short on a penny There's a lot in that little, yeah, <laughs> that yeah. little section right there I pulled up in the Muggsy I don't know if he's saying I pulled up in the Muggsy Bogues like the jersey The Muggsy Bogues jersey And then he had the pennies on Penny Hardaway's, but Muggsy Bowles was number one, right? And Penny Hardaway was number one as well, Yep. right? And then because I'm short on time, I think he's referencing, obviously, Muggsy Bowles' height. I'm short on time, so don't be short on a penny. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? So don't be playing with my time. Don't be short on nothing. You know what I mean? Time don't short line. me on nothing. Nothing. So I think that's what he's saying. That was a hard way to, yeah. to come in on. That was a lot of ones in that line. Penny, that's a one cent. You know what I mean? Yeah. So there's a lot of ones in there. That was in hard. That scheme. <laughs> I pulled up in the Muggsy Bogues with the pennies Cause I'm short on time So don't be short on a penny In our New York they would envy the flavor Now that's a bunch of white girls calling delis bodegas Elegant player Guys they call relevant major Look to me for how we step in their game So I'm like relevant to who because I'm not watching I feel like Jeff Van Gundy yelling stop flopping On the company they ain't even got stock options When you time this you don't care if you not pop Listen man, I gotta man. stop it I gotta stop it again. Marlon Craft is a New York dude, bro. To mm -hmm. the core. That motherfucker bleeds New York, man. Mm -hmm. I, I feel like if you cut his skin, you would see an Averex jacket underneath his skin or <laughs> some shit like that. God damn. You know what I'm saying? Because he said that old New York. He said, you know, back in, I think he said old New York, they would envy the flavor. Now it's a bunch of white chicks, you know, calling delis bodegas. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like, oh, now bodegas is what, you know, that's, yeah. that's what we call the, the, the poppy spots uh, in the hood. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? But now... The world is caught on, so yeah. it's lost the flavor, right? It's, it's lost the uniqueness, right? Yeah. Now it's, it's on TikTok and shit. So I'm like, relevant to who? Because I'm not watching. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? The guys y'all call relevant, I don't give a fuck. They're not relevant to me. I feel like Jeff Gundy. I'm yelling, stop flopping. Yeah. 
Yeah. Right. Jeff, the Jeff Van Gundy is uh, the, used to coach the New York Knicks, right? Yeah, yeah. And, you know, he was famous for saying, you know, people were flopping, right? Mm. But he's also saying stop flopping on the charts or stop flopping musically, mm. I think is also what he, what he could be saying. Then he said, own a company that ain't even got stock options. <laughs> then he said, when you're timeless, you don't, uh, you don't care if you're not popping. Mm. <laughs> mm. I, I like the line and I like the thought process behind the line. When you are timeless, it's not about being hot right now, right? And yeah. within the music industry, it's not about being like on the, on the charts and necessarily uh, uh, just the, the it guy for the moment. You know what I'm saying? You don't care about popping is what he's saying. Mm -hmm. that's, that's what popping means. When you're timeless, man, your shit will, will live on forever is what, is what he's saying. So I get that line and I appreciate that. But mm, I don't know. Stop flopping on the company. They ain't even got stock options. When you timeless, you don't care if you're not popping. Please. Married to this fly shit, I got poppins. Haters got a list mile long and shit, they not stopping. Shots dropping out here sipping scotch like I'm Ron Swanson. How you sign a deal to act gangster with a cop option? <laughs> new day, new work. Straight sauce like the drums could see. The kick make the groove work when clicks is the new worth. The risk to be true hurts. I live this, I'd lose first. Before I'd win, cutting corners just to up the score. Obstacles gon' pop at you, just got a budget for them. But look at the impression that the passion make. I guess there was a method to my madness, hey. I pulled up in the Chris Mullen, St. John's cause the storm coming. I see a lot of lightning, but I don't hear the thunder though. You gotta let it roll. I already told you I'm short on time. Fuck your little clicks, we do more offline. Okay. Bitch, I'm in a zone, why you so pressed? Give me what I'm owed, not a cent less. This ain't Morse code, say what you mean. Money come first, but the paper too green. Yeah, there gotta be something more that I'm running towards than the win. Snap back, but I'm yeah, well yeah, fitted. Yeah, he, he was cooking on that verse, though. Yes, he was. What did he say here, man, when he said, uh, how you sign a deal to act gangster with a cop option? Mm. I'm gonna take a stab at that. I feel like what he's saying is if when you sign these record deals claiming that you hard and gangster and thorough, you know what I'm saying, with a security option though, but I'm gonna do it. You know, I'm gonna do this gangster shit, this gangster rap shit, but I need some protection as well. <laughs> I feel like that's what he means with that cop option. I feel like it's like, yeah, you know, that's gonna, exactly how I'm, I'm thinking it, it. But I need security though, just yeah. so you know, you know what I'm saying? Like, how you do that though? You're supposed to be a gangster. That that kind of contradicts what being a gangster is all about. Like right. you can't work with the cops. You know what I'm saying? I thought that that's exactly how I'm taking it. When clicks is the new worth, the risk to be true hurts. Mm. So when clicks, the way I'm um, and interpreting that is is obviously when um, you're online and, and you want to get views and streams and clicks and shit like that, that's the new net worth. That's, your, that's what you're worth right now. The risk, so to be truthful on songs and really tell people what's really going on about you, it could hurt you because you may not be popping no more. Your only worth is the clicks. It's to be popular and jumping on trends and, and riding waves. So if you tell the truth, that shit could be detrimental to your career, bro. Yes, sir. He's all, I lose first before I cut corners, basically, just to up the score. And then he said, obstacles are going to pop up. You know what I'm saying? You just got a budget for them, baby. Tough. Strategically plan what you're going Prepare to do. Prepare for the worst. Prepare so, for shit to get real. Oh obstacles. My, I'm telling you. And then when he said, uh, I'd, I'd, rather do, I'd rather do that than cut corners. And rather than to, 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 te to take the, uh, the, uh, the shortcut. You know what I'm saying? Cut corners, be on some bullshit, whatever. Act like act like a donkey online. <laughs> you can you can put whatever, whatever you want, you want. Yeah. into that by cutting corners, right? F uh, fudging the numbers, right? Boosting mm -hmm. streams, you know what I mean? F streaming farms. I'd rather do it the hard way and just prepare myself for what may come. What do you say? Married to this fly shit I got poppins? <laughs> what <do you> say? <laughs> Mary Poppins is what he's referencing, right? And Mary Poppins, if you ever seen, you know, Mary Poppins, she flies in the air. But I'm married to this fly shit, though. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Being fly, being cool, being in vogue, right? This fly shit, New York shit. I pulled up into Chris Mullen, he said, St. John's, because the storm's coming. I see a lot of lightning, but I don't hear the thunder, though. You got to let it roll. So, um, obviously, he's referencing Chris Mullen, who was a, uh, uh, I don't know, he's a small forward or something like that for the Indiana Pacers back in the day. But I think he's pulling up in the Chris Mullen. He's saying the Chris Mullen jersey. Mm -hmm. And then Chris Mullen played for St. John's. And then he said St. John's because the, the, cause the storm's coming. Uh, St. John's, their, their uh, name, their school name, right, where their mascot was the storm, the red storm at St. John's. 
Um, and I and I see a lot of lightning, but I don't hear the thunder though. I think he's saying he sees a lot of flash in this industry, but he doesn't see the impact, right? He doesn't see the substance, right? So it's a lot of flash, yeah. You know, but I, I'm not. I don't hear. I don't hear nothing real. I don't hear yeah. the thunder. It's how I'm taking it. But you just gotta roll with it. You gotta let it roll. I think is what he's saying. You just gotta roll with it, and you know, my shit's timeless. Eventually, it'll come back. Maybe is what he's saying. But I thought that that was hard. He also said, "But look at the impression that this passion made." I guess you know there was a method to my madness, right? And this is coming after he talked about how he wasn't gonna take any shortcuts. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? He's gonna deal with the obstacles, right? You know, some people would look at that and say, "What the hell is he doing, man?" You know, you better take this shortcut. You better take them damn shortcuts. No, there's a there's a method. To my madness, the long, hard way, you know what I'm saying? It could lead to something great. Mm -hmm. And he's obviously has method man, method yep. to my madness in his video. Mm -hmm. I guess it's working, right? To yep. some degree, taking his route. So I thought that was dope. What you mean? The money come first, but the paper too green. Yeah, there gotta be something more that I'm running towards than the way. Snap back, but I'm well fitted. F it or well figured. I wish him well while I'm throwing pennies at well wishes. Okay. You get it later. I'm blunt with flavor like stale swishes. Smoke with the switcher that five stick you in hell quicker. Or hell the Riddler, the hell he raising the hell with you. Split up the click because they just that dude, yeah, no man. Dope. Just that dude, man. Love how he comes in, the energy, the Time. flow. Speaking of timeless, though, yeah. <laughs> that flow is timeless, yes, man. Yes, it is. What do you say, snap back, but I'm well fitted? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> That was hot. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but you know, uh, you know when you have a snapback hat, you know what I'm saying? But well fitted. But I feel like what he's saying, he's a throwback. Yeah. Me me method, man. I'm a throwback, but I'm still can jump up in this in this uh, rap game and be well in snapback. Be well ver versed and snap back into it. Yeah. I feel like that's what he was saying all in that little uh, one sentence. I'm fitted for this. I'm well fitted. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But he also could be referencing a fitted hat too, a snapback yeah. fitted also. That was hard. Uh -huh. What do you say? Wish him well while I'm throwing pennies at well wishers. Like, I wish you well, hoping for success, right? Because I wish him well, right? And throwing pennies at well wishers. Maybe he's giving you, I'll give you a little game. You know what I mean? While you hope and pray for this to work out for you. You know what I'm saying? Because when you go to a wishing well, you're hoping and praying for something mm -hmm. positive in your life. You know what I'm saying? So he's like, I wish you well on that. I hope it work out for but you, But you bro. don't think it's going to work out. Yeah. <laughs> I think the undertone of that line is like, yeah, here you go, bro. I wish you well, but that, that ain't going to happen. When you're trying to rap in what? You trying to become a rapper in 2024? Yeah. And you 38? <laughs> okay, I wish you well, bro. Snap back, but I'm well fitted. F it or well figured. I wish you well when I'm throwing pennies at well wishes. You get it later. I'm blunt with flavor like stale swishes. Smoke with the switcher that five stick you in hell quicker. Or hell the Riddler, the hell Raising the hell with ya Split up the click Cause they all switch No hell Hitler The Allen get you No Gilligan's I guy skipper Make sure your men know I'm the way by my ginger Don't be a boat rocker Cut a shot Both choppers Method over here scheming. Did he scheme? Yeah, yeah, I'm Did he you. scheme on 36 Chambers? Because I don't remember Method Man scheming. Like this. He was nice. Yeah. And he had incredible flow and cadence and all that other shit. And he was still nice lyrically. But was he scheming, yeah. though? I don't remember that. I feel like Method Man has gotten a little better when it comes to lyricism. Now, song making and all that other shit, you know, we can, y'all can, can debate that. But in terms of lyricism, I don't remember that. I think he's gotten more intricate. Yeah. Because he had this whole Gilligan Island, Gilligan's Island scheme mm -hmm. here. He said the island get you. No Gilligan's. Aye, aye, skipper. Make sure your men know I'm the wave like by Ginger. <laughs> don't be a boat rocker. Cut a shot. I don't even know where we stopped at, but I'm going to read ahead anyway. <laughs> don't be a boat rocker. Cut a shot. Both choppers. Old shot. That got your ears ringing. That's a door knocker. I we haven't even gotten there yet. I don't think, but that's crazy, yeah. though. <laughs> so he's referencing Gilligan's Island. It's a Gilligan's Island uh, scheme, right? You know, I I Skipper Skipper's a character on Gilligan's, Gilligan's Island. Also Gilligan as well. Um, and make sure your men know I'm the wave, uh, like by Ginger. So make S S Minnow was the boat uh, in Gilligan's Island, right? And he's the wave. He's the trend, right? He's the wave. Y'all gotta y'all gotta get with it, right? Yeah. He's the trend. Um, and he said, uh, like, by Ginger, right? So, obviously, Minnow, a boat is on water. There's waves in the water, right? And he's the trend, but also by Ginger. By G Ginger's another character in Gilligan's Island. She waved, I believe, in the intro. I think so, yeah. She waved by, I right? So. By Ginger. But don't be a boat rocker. Don't disturb what's going on yeah. over here. Don't be a boat rocker. Cut a shot, both choppers. If you, if you do disturb shit, we got the choppers on deck, mm -hmm. is what he's saying. Cut a shot, both choppers. Old shot that got your ears ringing. That's a door knocker. So, old shot, I think he's just, again, that's gunplay shit mm -hmm. right there. You know what I mean? It's got your ears ringing. 
Um, but that's a door knocker. You know what a door knocker is, man. That's old school, man. Yeah. The, la the ladies used to wear the big hoop with earrings. We call them knockers. door knockers. Yeah. If you ever seen a door knocker, you know it's like a, it's a round thing that's hooked to a door, and you yeah. you yeah. knock the door with it. Mm -hmm. But it's got your ears ringing. It's like a ear, a ring on your ear. Essentially, is what mm -hmm. he's saying. So that all was crazy. We haven't even gotten that far, but that was crazy. I'm blunt with the flavor, like stale swishers. Mm. I smoke with the swisher. That five stick, you would hell quicker. Mm. All hell the Riddler. The hell he raised and the hell with you. Split up the click because they all switch. No hell Hitler. That whole scheme, and I know I didn't do it justice, but God, that whole scheme yeah. and how he yeah. rolled the fuck out of that and the wordplay was crazy, man. It was. Great, great verse thus far by Method Man. <laughs> She smoke with the switcher, that five stick you in hell quicker. Or hell the Riddler, the hell he raised in the hell with ya. Split up the click, cause they all switch, no hell Hitler. The Allen get you, no Gilligan's, I die skipper. Make sure your men know, I'm the way, bye bye ginger. Don't be a boat rocker, cut a shot, both choppers. Old shot that got your ears ringing, that's a dough knocker. Blow dropper, I go acapella like the old opera. Flow proper, I say absolute like this the old vodka. I feel at home, partner. You and your partners be at home, got gotcha. you waiting on that bag, you some home shopping. Show time to a show watcher. I show the parts where they show doctors about to pull a plug. I'm a showstopper. Woo! On Harlem nights, I'm a globe trotter and gold products plus the gold standard. My gold diggers and gold slaughter. Two minds craft, so me and Marlon can craft a monster. That chupacabra, the shooter come with the Uber driver. Woo! You're not a rider, you and your sponsors forgot them bonkers. My coach is conjured with DS hotter than blocking yonkers. Not a monster who's all the war at the bot and conquer, but I wear fitted like Humphrey Bogart and Cocker. Hey, I told crazy. you I'm short on time Fuck your little clicks, we do more offline Bitch, I'm in a zone, why you so pressed? Give me what I'm owed, not a cent less This ain't Morse code, say what you mean The money come first, but the paper too green There gotta be something more that I'm running towards than the wind Yeah Come I got on. standards. Come I got no rules. Stop playing with me. I'm trying, man. <laughs> For real, man. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, good. I mean, bro. Could do, That's like, why I appreciate the respect, like that you've seen. I'm trying to hit for a while. Trying to hit for a while, but not only that, I, I, I got us a little excellent. Uh, nice. Nice. Yeah, that's dope. How you feel? Cause you're not only that. That's dope. Again, Marlon, just let me know. I hope you on your journey and all that. Dope, fam. Up. I love those dope. That's dope, man. That's method, though. You know, and they have that stamp like that. Yep, exactly. Dude, that means a lot. And I know Marlon appreciates that. I, I know that means a lot to him. Yeah, Method did a thing with um, Math Hoffa on um, he, where he battled Math Hoffa. Method, he doesn't need to be doing this. He doesn't need to to, to link up with uh, a battle rapper and do a song. He, he ain't going to make that money. Well, I, I don't know, but it's, I don't <laughs> think it's going to be the most lucrative monetarily for Method Man to do certain things. But this is an up-and-coming rapper still. Marlon Craft's still up-and-coming. He may have been doing this for a while, but he's still on the come up. Um, and Method noticed his talent and was just like, fuck it. I'm, I'm just, I'm rocking with you just because you're dope at what you do. Fuck all the extra yeah. shit and, and what kind of look it's going to give me and how it's going to benefit me. I just think you're great at what you do. That has to mean everything, right? That's what Marla said. It's a method to my madness taking the hard uh -huh. way and just and barring up. So uh, yeah, that, that, that was great, man. He's a, he's a real dude, man. He's a stand-up dude for that. What did Method say, man? He said, you and your partners be at home. <laughs> y'all waiting on the bag. Y'all some home shoppers. <laughs> That was tough. Though. That's a hard-ass line, man, because basically what he's saying is you can't wait for shit to happen to, to you. You got to go out there and get it, bro. I thought that was a funny-ass yeah. line. Yeah. Waiting on the money to come is what he's saying. You're yeah. waiting on the bag, the yeah. money. But obviously, when you home shop, you get bags delivered to your door. But you wait, you, you and your partner ain't doing shit with your life. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Two minds craft so me and Marlon can craft a monster. That's Chupacabra. <laughs> Isn't that like a monster? Isn't that like, like a, a um, boogeyman? It's like a, yeah. it's like a Mexican <laughs> boogeyman or some shit like that, like a, a mythical boogeyman yeah. creature in Mexico or something like that. Like that, there's like sucks your blood. I think. I think. Don't quote me on that. And what? What the uh, the shooter comes with the Uber driver? <laughs> Apparently. <laughs> show time to a show watcher. I show the parts where they show doctors about to pull the plug. I'm a show stopper. Mm. So Showtime, obviously, he's, I think he's referencing it just being a show mm -hmm. on TV. I show the parts where they show the doctors pulling the plug. Mm -hmm. It ends the show. That's it. Someone's dying, right? Or whatever the case may be in said show. I'm a show stopper. That was super hard. Just the word playing that, how you deliver that hard. On Harlem, on Harlem nights, I'm a globetrotter and globe products. 
Plus the gold standard, my gold diggers is gold slogger. Mm -hmm. Two then he went to the uh, yeah. Minecraft joint. That mm -hmm. just again how he was floating on his track, wordplay and cadence in this is crazy and slick lines, beautiful. Mm -hmm. He he also mentioned Coast Contra in there, man. That was a nod to Coast Contra. So just again, just method is uh, method man is just sort of aware yep. of the guys that are up and coming. That's staying true to the art form. That is what I'm taking, right? He did the the battle with Mav Hoffa, right? He's plugged into that and mm -hmm. battle rap in general. Then he's um, doing something with Marlon Craft, and he does something. I think he did some stuff with Griselda, too, if I'm not mistaken. I think he did a joint with, if I'm not mistaken, Conway. Um, maybe yeah. a few joints, if I'm not mistaken, mm -hmm. with them. and uh, Or maybe West Side Gun. And now he's mentioning Coast Contra, so that tells me that Method Man is making a concerted effort to support, because he even said that at the end of the Marlon Craft video, like, yo, I'm going to support you on your journey, man, whatever you need. You know what I'm saying? And I just think that, that his that's his way of reaching back and giving back mm -hmm. to the culture and trying to keep it alive, if you get you know what I'm saying, mm -hmm. <laughs> by supporting artists like this, which is super dope. He also said, I'm not a mobster whose art of war is divide and conquer. And when I think of that line, I'm not someone who's trying to divide and conquer. If anything, I'm trying to unify. Right. I think by him getting with Marlon Craft and mentioning Coast Contra and Math Hoffa, that's his way of trying to keep everything together. It's not like underground guys. Yeah. It's not underground guys versus popping guys or whatever the case may be. The old school dudes that are still successful, that have, have legacies, can still reach back and come together. We're not trying to divide and conquer, man. We're trying to come together. So I thought that that was dope to end it. I love that collaboration. We all know Marlon Craft can rap his ass off. Great lyricist, though, man. Marlon yeah. Craft's a great lyricist, man. I, I, I can't nitpick anything lyrically with him. I think that it, we're lucky to have people like this that represent hip-hop yes. on a high level. Method Man is a legend, and he's still still is rapping. I think Method Man gets with the right production, can put out a classic now if he yeah, wants to. Yeah, I think so Get him too. with Mad Lib or somebody like that. He didn't sound washed at all. Not and I'm gonna keep real. And yeah. yes, a lot of old school rappers sound horrible to me often, often. And Method Man didn't sound like that at all. He sounded fresh, fresh out the 90s, man. Yep. So salute, salute to Method Man. Man, that was a pleasure for us to break down, old man. Give us more from Marlon Craft. We'll keep following his yes, journey sir. as well. That's the end of the video. If you guys enjoyed it, please hit the like button. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. Make sure you guys check us out on deftheradio.com. That's our website. It's a great way to support the channel by joining that website. The information for deftheradio.com will be in the description below. I'm George. That's Ryan. Las Vegas. We, we out. out.